Hi everyone, today we're going to talk about Microsoft's .NET framework and why it's worth learning more about it. So if you're interested in software development or just curious about what .NET is, let's dive in. The .NET framework is a software framework developed by Microsoft that provides a platform for building and running various applications, including desktop, web, and mobile apps. Its main purpose is to provide a common set of libraries and APIs for developers to use, making it easier to build and maintain applications. One main feature that makes the .NET framework so popular among developers is its support for multiple programming languages. Developers can write their source code in the language they're familiar with, such as c -sharp, Visual Basic, or F-Sharp. It's even possible to use .NET with a popular Python language if you use Python.NET. Another important feature of the .NET framework is security. The framework includes built-in security features that help protect against various security threats, such as malicious code, data theft, and unauthorized access to sensitive information. Developers who create software using .NET will rely on several components to make their jobs easier. Some of the main components you'll likely encounter in developing a .NET app are CLR, the Common Language Runtime, FCL, the Framework Class Library, c -sharp, .NET's bespoke programming language, VB.NET, Visual Basic for .NET, ASP.NET, the .NET web development platform, Windows Forms, that make desktop app design simple, WPF, the Windows Presentation Foundation, Entity Framework, providing easy database work without SQL, Link, or Language Integrated Query, WCF, Windows Communication Foundation, CLI, the .NET command line interface. These are just a few of the many components and features available in the .NET framework. There's always something new to learn and explore. There are three main flavors of .NET, each with its own strengths and use cases. There's .NET Framework, which is the classic flavor of .NET. Then there's .NET Core, the cross-platform flavor. Now that's just called .NET. And finally, there's Xamarin, which is the native mobile flavor of .NET. As with any software toolset, there are bound to be bugs either in .NET itself or in the apps developed using the system. So let's look at some common issues you may face either as a .NET developer or as somebody using apps made with .NET. Common issues for developers include package management issues, performance issues, and deployment issues. For users, issues can arise from error messages, poor performance, .NET framework mismatches, and general .NET app crashes. Whether you love it or hate it, .NET is sure to be around for many years and on most devices you use. If you decide to make your own software, it's definitely an option that should be on your shortlist. That's it for today's video. If you found it helpful, make sure to give it a thumbs up and subscribe for more content like this. There's an in-depth and comprehensive article linked in the description below if you want to know more about .NET beyond this basic overview. So check it out. See you next time.